This is the Aztec ozone generator model 8403, um, manufactured by Applied Materials. Um, its purpose is to generate a high purity level of ozone. Inside is the ozone barrier discharge cell, which is the heart of the instrument. But along with associated controls and electronics, it produces this high level of uh, pure ozone. The instrument is a water-cooled unit and requires cooling water of uh, no more than 20 degrees C uh, with pressure of 60 psi. Um, also, uh, it also requires the purchase of a matching male plug to go to the power connection. For purposes of our demonstration, we have wired it uh, directly to the uh, internal uh, terminal block. Normally, the uh, regulated mixture of oxygen and nitrogen, which is necessary to produce ozone, would be connected here with the ozone actually being discharged through this fitting here. Uh, for purposes of our demonstration, we are just going to use the natural oxygen and nitrogen that's present in the room to show uh, how the generator works. simple to operate. After you throw in the power switch, it has a set of LEDs that are acting as both alarms and um, interlocks. Interlocks for the uh, interior, uh, over current protection, uh, the actual temperature of the cell itself, making sure that it's up to temperature, along with water temperature and a temperature of the entire system. Um, for purposes of demonstration, we've hooked it up to a ozone analyzer. Now normally in everyday atmosphere, ambient temperatures, whether that be indoors or outdoors, um, there is always ozone present. And you can expect to see levels anywhere from 0.0 up to about 0.8. Uh, but it will normally detect at least the ozone in the room. Uh, presently, We've also set an alarm level for 0 0.45 parts per million. Now all we do is switch on the generator. I've set the generator up, which can be controlled with this uh, bot right here, to about 22 to 25 uh, grams per hour. That's the way that they measure the output of this generator, grams per hour. That will translate approximately to uh, about 0 0.50 parts per million. Now, if we look at the analyzer, we can tell that the analyzer has gone up from 0 0.02 to 0 0.41, and momentarily, it samples every 6 to 12 seconds. Now we've hit where our alarm level was, but the program is set up so in case it gets a momentary spike, it'll, it will read three more times. And if the level has not dropped below the low alarm set point, then the alarm will sound and say, stay activated until that level is back below the set point. Sounded. So what we'll do is we'll turn off our ozone generator. And once again the ozone
ozone level has dropped below um, the uh, alarm set point. The unit is very simple to operate. Um, in a normal setting, this would be connected to, again, a regulated source of uh, oxygen and nitrogen. nitrogen. But even here, just the picking up the, uh, the nitrogen and oxygen in the room, it is that sensitive and it controls very well.